The old rowboat needed a new coat of paint, and the old friends could use one as well. They climbed on board, all loaded down with well over two centuries of wealth. The ballast of good fortune, history, and art pressed the boat to its waterline. They had made this voyage many times before and were sure everything would be fine. But as they rowed to the middle of the lake, one oar was lost to the tide. The current was swift, and all that was left was one oar for just one side. Not to worry, said the friend on the right, I can row us in from here. As he saw the flash of a lightning bolt, and thunder fell on his ear. Round and round in circles he rowed as the storm came bearing down until the leftward friend said, give it to me, and then he rode round and round. Opposite circles were then described, and the water began to pour in, as back and forth they fought to decide whose rowing was going to win. But the storm didn't care which one would win, the battle of who owns the oar, because the water spilled in, the treasure was lost, sunken so far from the shore. They continued to fight as to who was to blame, treading water until they were spent. In exhaustion, they sank in each other's arms, clinging in their descent. Now the storm has waned, the sun has come out, and nature has gone on its way. The lake is smooth, no signs of the boat or the fools who went rowing that day. <laughs> 